Hello, I'm Chris Menard. I have a great treat for you today using Microsoft Teams. I'm going to show you how to add an Excel file as a tab inside of a channel in Microsoft Teams. I decided to do this because I'm a Microsoft creator, which means some of the videos that I make end up on Microsoft's 365 YouTube channel. Just to quickly show you a couple of them, I'm on Microsoft's 365 channel. Uh, dictate function improved, that is my video there. Add your signature to Word, that's my video over there on the left. Year over year growth analysis, that is also me regarding personal finance. So when I go to the Microsoft 365 creator team, they have a spreadsheet out there and all the videos that get added and all the videos that get removed from, uh, from me and other Microsoft creators. So let me show you how to add an Excel file. And this is really cool. So I'm already in a team called finance. I'm on the forecasting channel. You always have three tabs by default post, files, and wiki. So if I come up here to add an Excel file, there's Excel. If you don't see it, just search for it in the top right. It pulls up the forecasting channel. I can't add the Excel file right now, and the reason is I've got nothing but a bunch of JPEG images there. Everything you see here that's slightly grayed out, I'm going to close this, is coming from the Files tab. So you have to have the Excel file inside the channel first. So I could hit upload, but I'm just going to drag and drop a file and let go. So now that I've got a file inside the channel, I can add that file as a tab. So let's go do that. Add a tab, Excel. Look, there it is. Click it once. Do you want to post to this channel about this tab? That is up to you. You probably do though, so I'm going to leave that checked. Hit save. So you're about to see what that Excel file looked like inside of a tab in the forecasting channel. Two worksheet, one says lots of data. Let's see if that's actually right, it is. And the other one says short data. But now I can quickly get here from within this channel, up at this tab, and I can even insert column chart. There we go. Let's change a couple of these numbers. 4,000, 3,500, they're changing in the chart. Really cool feature. So that's what Microsoft does with the creator's channel, showing us what they've added and what they've removed. And I'm just showing you how they did this. I really like this feature. Multiple people can edit this file at one time. And also, just so you know this, it's not just Excel. Type in Word, and there's Word also. But it's usually Excel that I like to use this for. If you have any questions about this video or any questions about Microsoft Teams, please let me know. Thank you for your time. Feel free to subscribe to my channel. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.